Okay, everybody ready? Lights, camera, and now action. Oops, it doesn't work, right? And this is because my pivot point. Yeah, in this movie, I want to talk about the pivot point. And the pivot point allows me to place the point of gravity. Uh, well, actually, it is uh, the pivot point is the point of gravity of my object. And right now, as you can see, I am rotating. And but the pivot point of this object is in the middle of this object right here. OK, and if I want to rotate this uh, like a slate film, I need to move my pivot point. And how can I do that? Well, actually, there is uh, different ways. The first one is here in my uh, pa uh, parameters panel. All right. And what I can do here, you can see pivot. I can move this, for example, let's say in the X direction to right and whoops what happened here I can do it uh, two here in my y-axis okay and I can do it here and here we are so you can see how we can move our pivot point but actually there is another way well actually I like it uh, better and that is by selecting my object right click again and here I can go to my pivot uh, mode I can click here and now you can see that we have an another handles they look uh, almost like uh, these ones down here and we have our X, Y and Z so I can move my pivot point in this position if I want to okay and then I can move it down a little bit right here and that's it now I have uh, I changed the position of my pivot point and with my mouse and you can see how we change the parameters here these values in pivot in my parameters uh, panel uh, we have different options right now with different uh, units and now what I can do is select my rotation tool again and if I want to get out of this mode I have to press the key insert remember and now I am back in my selection mode with rotation tool and I can rotate and now I can say action and that's how we can move our pivot point and remember it's really important because uh, like I told you it's something like uh, the point of gravity or of your objects and wherever you place this uh, pivot point, you're going to have a different, completely different result. So, for example, if I change that to 2 again, you can see that now my pivot point is here and I have different scenario. All right. So make sure that you have uh, your pivot points in the right position when you are trying to animate some kind of things. And I see you in the next movie.